Hi, I'm Todd Haber with Micron Optics in Atlanta, Georgia. We design and manufacture high precision tunable Fabry Pro optical filters, swept wavelength interrogators, fiber brad grading optical sensors, and high speed swept wavelength lasers for medical and industrial imaging applications. Today I'd like to talk to you about our Fiber Fabry Pro tunable component. The Fiber Fabry Pro consists of two dielectric mirrors directly deposited to fiber end faces. The spacing between the mirrors determines the tuning range or the free spectral range of the optical filter, whereas the finesse is determined by the reflectivity of the mirrors. The free spectral range can also be seen as the spectral spacing between two adjacent peaks, and the finesse determines the contrast between the peak transmission and the peak rejection wavelengths of the individual filter. The bandwidth is a function of those two and allows uh, and determines how much light is able to pass through the full width half max of each resonant peak. The Fabry Pro can be air gap tuned, thereby changing the distance between the mirrors with a piezoelectric actuator, allowing that resonance wavelength to be tuned to any wavelength within the filter's passband. I'd like to show you how the tunable filter works. Here on this board we have two different models of Fabry Pro tunable filter installed in a typical application. Uh, they're simply voltage tuned as represented by this potentiometer uh, in the associated display. On the screen you see two tunable filters. In blue we have a 100 nanometer free spectral range, a lower finesse tunable filter of finesse 100. In the green we have a higher finesse filter, 160 nanometers and a finesse of 1000. The higher finesse results in a narrower passband and a higher contrast ratio as is seen on the green filter. And by simply changing the voltage on these filters, you can see that the resonance frequencies are able to be easily and reliably tuned. Thanks for watching. For additional information, visit us on the web at micronoptics.com.